I woke up at about 3 o'clock this morning. Well, in fact, I woke up at 2.30 this morning. The first image that I woke up with was we'd be talking about premonitions. Exactly. I, well, it's, it's interesting because I woke up at midnight and I thought, yeah, well, we'll be talking about pre- premonitions later in the morning. And lo and behold, here we are. Here we are, talking now, premonitions. This comes out of the MH17 air crash a, a week ago where an 11 year old boy kept saying to his mother, you know, goodbye. Um, I'm a little bit worried about this flight. He had he'd clearly had a sense that something was about to happen with that flight. Um, and it, as we all know now, it was shot down over that field in uh, eastern Ukraine a week ago. Um, almost 300 people lost their lives. We spoke this morning to an American academic. This is a proper scientist, not some sort of mystical witch doctor who talks about psychic experiences and, and spirits. This is a real scientist doing real research. And her findings have astounded her and a lot of her colleagues because she thinks she's actually found evidence that supports the fact that human beings can actually have a premonition, yeah. even a few seconds into the future. Well, she's found that when people make a, a good or a bad decision, there's a increase in heart rate, there are, there are twitches within the body, but it's so small, like if you, it's not something you could go, oh, I'll go yes or no. It's so infinitesimal, but they're continuing to research it because it doesn't really explain why when you're going to go, you know, for a, a, a correct decision or a wrong decision, why your body would have this this little instant, tiny instant of, of, of premonition of what you're about to do. So they're continuing to look at this and you'd be shocked to hear that she's been getting calls from people like investment bankers who want to know whether they, you know, ser- they, they would be seriously wanting to know if they, ho- they could hook themselves up to a machine. So if they go buy or sell and then the machine says buy or sell because they have a premonition of it. So... It, it, look, it, it sounds weird to me, but there's so much that we don't know, isn't there? We, mm. we don't know why a mother who's got a connection with a son on the other side of the world wakes up in the middle of the night because the son's been involved in a car accident. We've heard plenty of stories like that. There's oh, things we don't right know. Through. There are things we don't know, but what, what I do know is this. We're, uh, she's agreed to go to the casino with us, so uh, we're right. running a little bit late. We better get moving now. We're going to clean up.